Hello YouTube. So today I'm going to show you how to put the Kodi app onto the Fire Stick. Uh, we are in November of 2015, so anything after this, I don't know if it's going to work, but this is working right now. So let me go ahead and show you what to do. Once you hook up your Fire Stick, this is going to be your home screen right here. So what we're going to have to do first is go down to settings. We go to system. We're going to go to developer options. Turn both of these on. Just hit OK here. Then back out of that. You're also going to want to take note in the about section of your IP address under network. You can see mine is right there and I'll show you why later. We're going to have to connect to this with the computer later on. So back out of there. Next, we're going to go to applications and just take this collect app usage data off. Hit OK, turn off. OK, and now we're ready to go ahead and get the Kodi app installed. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the apps section. OK, once in here, scroll down to categories. We're going to go all the way to the right and go to productivity. Click on that and download this uh, ES file explorer. We're gonna need that to be able to access the Kodi website. So we're gonna hit download and I'll be back as soon as this is done. Okay, so that is done downloading and now installing, I can open it. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. And you're gonna wanna adjust this to fit your TV so you can see the whole web page. So I just make it small enough so it works. So I hit accept. Okay, so this is what the ES thing, the ES file manager looks like. Can't really see on the focus here. See if I can get that to focus on that side. Move that for you. Okay, if you see where it says favorite, we're gonna click on that. Then you're gonna click on add there. And then in the middle, it should say path. So you're gonna click where it says path so you can type in a path. I'm going to put HTTP colon four slash four slash Cody dot TV. and then hit next and we're just gonna label it Cody this is where you're just labeling it labeling the favorites so we'll put Cody there hit next and then go down and make sure you highlight add on the right it should turn gray can't really see it on the video but it turns gray and then hit add once it's added now towards the left you'll see on the left hand side we're scrolling down and then you can see the Cody shortcut we just created click on that and it's going to open up the website for you so this is access accessing the website like if you would do it on the desktop so we're going to go right here we see a little blue marker on the top click there it says download apologies if you can't read that and uh, you're going to kind of go down and where the little android guy is at there's a link that says arm. You can kind of see where it just appeared right there, arm. You're gonna click that. And it's gonna download. So I'll be right back as soon as this is done. Okay, so that's finished now. So I'm gonna go ahead and highlight open file. It should be gray. We're gonna click on that. It's gonna open the file. And we're gonna go to install. And scroll all the way down till you highlight install. And it should be installing now shortly. This shouldn't take too much longer. Okay, so app hasn't been installed, the Kodi app. Um, I don't really need to open it right now, so I'm just going to hit done. And we're going to back out all the way to the home screen. Okay, so back out, back out of this, back out of this. Okay, so we're back to the home screen, okay? So just to double check to see if Cody's on here, we're gonna go to settings 
and go to applications click on that and you're gonna want to scroll all the way down to manage installed applications and we can scroll down here and we can see that Cody has been installed on here now if I click on this uh, it'll start Cody I'm not gonna go into how to set up the Cody app in this video uh, to create all of the the, the, the add-ons and the shortcuts to be able to watch movies and all that good stuff uh, but I'm just teaching you how to put the Kodi app on the Fire Stick itself. So we can see that it's on here. So the other problem that we have is uh, we don't ha have any way of accessing the Kodi app in the home screen of the Amazon Fire Stick. For example, you don't see it here. Um, you don't see it anywhere here. The only way you can access it is if you go all the way down in settings, like I did, and go to applications and again go to manage installed apps and then you can see it here and you can click on it here and go through it this way but uh, the next step I'm going to do is uh, show you how we can get an icon uh, on the home screen uh, using what's called uh, fire starter and that's going to create us a give us another home screen so I'm going to pause it and we're going to go to my computer and remember I wrote down the IP address to my network uh, to the fire stick so I can access it to the computer so I'll see you in the computer Okay, so we're back to what we're going to do to be able to connect to the Fire Stick via the PC. Um, I'm using Windows 8 and uh, I'm on Windows Surface Pro. I don't think that really matters. What you want to do is download the ADB Fire. Um, I should be able to post a link on the description for you guys. But this is all you do. So once you see this, you don't really need to do any changes on anything. Just simply click on New. So we're going to go ahead and click on New here okay and you're gonna wanna call it whatever you want I'm gonna call this one fire stick 6 okay fire stick 6 okay so when you're adding something new you just wanna put uh, right there in the description I put fire stick 6 and the address is that uh, IP address that you see in the network okay then you're gonna hit save okay, so let's click on save okay so that's it and then uh, if you have more than one you're gonna click here so we just made fire stick six I'm gonna click on that and we're gonna go click on connect and this shows that it's connected right here so what we're gonna do is just click over here on this button that says fire starter so just click on that and then hit install and this shouldn't take too long okay fire starter is installed so that's all we need to do on the computer okay so now we can go back to the fire stick and see if it worked okay so now we're back to the fire stick so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to the application section which is right here just to show you again under settings all the way in the bottom go to applications click on that and we're gonna go to manage installed apps click on that and look for fire starter it should be there just like Cody was so you click on Firestarter, just click that there. And we're going to launch application. And there you see Amazon Fire TV Home or Kodi. So now what this actually does is every time I hit the home button on my remote, it'll actually take me to that screen instead. So we can now see the Kodi app right here. So we can just click on Kodi there. And uh, this is the first time it's running because I didn't open it after the install. let that load up there and it should go black for just a second and there it is Cody is working on the app like I said I am not gonna go in through how to program the Cody app on here to make it uh, viewable for movies and shows and all that good stuff just showing you how to get it onto the fire stick as easy as possible uh, leave comments subscribe for more videos and if you have any questions, let me know. Hit the like button if you like the video. Um, on the next ones, I'll do a little bit better for the focusing and all that good stuff. But hopefully this helps you out. It's pretty easy. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.